Hi everyone! Today we're making award ribbons inspired by Franklin Boggs painting, Wisconsin County Fair. State fairs occur in late summer or early fall. Farmers share their livestock, fruits and vegetables, and even baked goods like pies. You can also find entertainment like carnival rides and live music. And there's always delicious food served from food trucks. State fairs also have art competitions. This artwork was entered into a special competition in 1948 that celebrated the 100th anniversary of Wisconsin becoming a state. This painting shows a small window into life at a Wisconsin fair. On the top left, we see people lining up with dairy cows. They could be waiting to be judged in a competition. This cow and farmer are resting in an indoor area. There are multiple ribbons hanging in the back from a county fair and a grand prize blue ribbon tied in the front. Today, we're gonna make our own prize ribbons. You can award it to yourself or to someone you know. I'm gonna make a prize ribbon for my sister's dog. She has the best fluffy tail wag. I'm going to add special drawings and designs to make it unique and personalized. I'm using a three inch wide satin ribbon, a ruler, scissors, fabric markers, a needle, white thread, and sequins. First, I measure and cut my ribbon to the length I want. I'm gonna make my ribbon 10 inches long. I thread my needle and tie a knot at the end. I fold the top corners down in the back, forming a triangle, and I sew them in place. I cut a V-shape at the bottom of the ribbon by folding the ribbon in half and cutting. I use fabric markers to decorate my ribbon. I sew on sequins to make it extra special. After I finish my design, I use a needle to sew string through the top of the ribbon and I tie off a loop. I hope you enjoy making your own award ribbon here at the Coles Art Studio or at home. Bye.